hello everyone so in this video we are going to cover ibm interview question ibm automation interview question and answer so here you can see the first question that uh, we will have is related to test ng what will execute first before method or before test so as you know before method annotation will execute before the before method annotation next is cucumber related questions what is glue keyword very important if you haven't um, in, uh, worked on cucumber then it will be difficult for you to explain so the glue is a part of cucumber auction that describe the location and path of the step definition where you have kept your step definition file so it glue it mean to say is redirect so this is the uh, sample test runner file so here you can see we have uh, glue step definition so this is how you can use glue and the path of step definition and above and uh, more important uh, in glue it contains the location of feature file and the package contain the corresponding step files thus it glue the feature file with the step definition that we use next is what do you mean by a framework name the type of framework available in the market so basically a framework is a set of rule guideline and best practices that are followed to get the desired result a testing framework should have the feature listed below so first of all you need to understand the framework and why what is the importance of this from framework I mean framework should support more than one browser multiple platform multiple programming language uh, such as java python c sharp ruby and so on so this is a combination like if you are going to automate something or going to uh, automate your test case then what all things should be there in that package or framework so these are the best practices that anyone has to follow next is what do you mean by a framework and name the type of i mean same i mean the framework should be efficient in handling test data test creation and updating are easy and maintainable this is the main important part of framework you can create your test script on different files but if somebody is not using that this is there is no use of that i have created login method you have already created your login method then what is the use of that we need to use the same or common login method provision for setting priority for each test case efficient test report generation proper test history maintenance interpreting uh, interpreting trends analysis for execution result integration with continuous integration tools like jenkins minimum manual intervention this is all about framework next is type it. type of automation testing frameworks are listed below keyword driven framework next is data driven framework behavioral driven modular and hybrid framework what is hash map java hash map class implements the map interface by using a hash table it inherit abstract map class and implements map interface the important point about java hash map class are hash map contains value based on key contains only unique element may have one null key multiple null values and no order maintains what is abstraction is the process of hiding implementation detail and showing only functionality to the user so let's take the example of sms sendings so if you are need to send any sms to your friend you will be focusing on how you write sms and how it is going to achieved by or received by the your friend but you do do not interested in the internal working of the sms system so this is all about abstraction have you used abstraction in your automation project function to read and write the date from excel i mean this is the example that you can give like uh, when i need to read uh, the date or write the date in the excel then i use the abstraction in my framework so this is how i mean uh, you can explain maybe uh, some question related to how you have used oops concepts in your framework next is exception handling can we have multiple catch for same try and how it is written answer is yes rule number 1 at a time only one exception is occurred 
and at a time only one catch block is executed rule number 2 all catch block must be ordered from most specific to most general that is catch for arithmetic must come before catch for exception so this is how like some generic exception and the global exception class why do why to use maven maven is based around the central concept of build life cycle so this basically maven used for uh, i mean uh, used as a build life cycle i mean it has it has uh, multiple uh, I mean, this like maven life cycle contains multiple uh, steps or multiple phases uh, like default clean and site so when you use uh, i mean the advantage of using maven is like it used to give you a proper structure and a pom.xml file so by using pom.xml file you can put your dependencies and you can use that like we use for selenium and apart from that it is automatic uh, automatic build process it has multiple life cycles like uh, we can uh, may, we can use clean we can use default we can use site we can use package we can use deployment and test and multiple steps multiple phases in this life cycle so when i say clean it used to clean the Uh, I mean your project files, and this is how we can explain. Next is difference between thread dot sleep and implicit. So thread dot sleep is hard wait, will be, will wait even after element are displayed. Obviously you know, like it will stop your script for those seconds. And implicit wait, it will be applicable as a global wait. And once declared at the beginning of the program of the core framework. it will be applicable for, to all web element it means to save your 10 lines of code and you have declared implicit wait top of it then it is applicable to each and every line how to select a value from a static drop down in selenium very important question so there are multiple things like select by visible text it used to take an argument as string i mean to say visible text country is a drop down for example country is drop down you need to select the india as a text then string india as a visible text this method is most commonly used as a drop down and you can see i mean here like select as is a new select and we used to pass the element and object of this select by visible text next next is indexing you can pass the index like 1 2 3 i mean and after that select by value you can use select by value as this so there are different attribute in a tag so one is indexing one for value one is for visible text next is uh, i mean so this is uh, all about uh, uh, selecting your value from the drop down so few generic questions uh, like what do you know about ibm why do you want to work for us so once you clear the round some generic question will be asked by the hr or your hiring manager or sometimes so these are the question that uh, they ma uh, they may ask about like what was the most challenging part of your previous job what would you do if uh, you won 1 million pounds so they want uh, uh, your i mean they want to know about your think thinking like uh, if you i mean you used to like a challenging jobs or a very easy job so these are the question like uh, what is your approach to your leadership how um, and uh, tell me one thing that ibm has done recently that impress you who is the ceo what are the competitor why are you applying to this role why should we hire you or pick you so sometimes uh, there are i mean these are some generic question and uh, you know like if you are applying for ibm then you should know about uh, these things at least and uh, after that uh, question might be how many petrol station are there in xyz location tell me about a time when you solve the problem creatively give some example from your own experience which shows your leadership and initiative skills so this is all about 